Hi everyone, thank you so much for coming along and checking out the 31 products. I know you guys have been seeing me on YouTube doing this and some of you guys have expressed interest in just seeing what are the 31 products and what am I doing these days. So I'm just going to go over, if you guys have been watching, you know that I've been having a lot of problems with going live. So instead of going live, I am just going to record this and then post it on YouTube and then I will just answer your questions through the comments. So if you have any questions, you can just leave them in the comments below and I will get back to you. All right. So is it done? Okay. Just turn it off. Yes. Charity is in the middle of making a no cook baked macaroni and cheese where you don't cook the noodles. And it's the first time she's made it. So she was asking about how to tell if it was done or not because some of the noodles are still a little crunchy. Um, I'm just going to start out with my giveaway. For all of you who are interested in purchasing, I am giving away this gorgeous um, faux leather purse. It's a little bit bigger than my standard purse right now. And for every $35 that you spend, you'll get an entry into um, winning one of these. And it comes with the purse as well as the Uptown Mini pouch. And you can see the color is like a dark navy blue with a champagne dot. But this bag can be used as just a handbag with the straps, or you can use this like a crossbody, and it has the shoulder strap here. So it really is nice to be able to use it in whatever way you want to. Um, but this is just a really nice purse. Mine is a hot pink, and I absolutely love the hot pink. The gray is more of a classic color, and very, very versatile. You can just wipe it down. There's also a pocket right on the outside here. And that's where you can store your cell phone. So you don't have to unearth it, your cell phone, out of the deep depths of your purse. I don't know about you guys, but that is always happening to me. Where's my cell phone? Where's my cell phone? It's buried at the bottom of my purse. So my purse that I use is the Demi Day bag. And this is a new um, new purse for this season, and it looks like that. I'll put it on for you. I love this bag because it's um, it's a canvas material and it's lightweight. This print is very hold that up for you guys. is a very classy print, and you can use it winter time. You can use it for the summertime. They do have a really cla um really fun. Uh, I think it's called Loopsy Daisy print. Um, let's see if I can find it for you guys. And that's a white and navy blue print with um, hot pink and yellow swirls. I just, I absolutely love that print. Um, I don't have this purse in that print currently. Let's see, here it is. I don't know if you guys can see that print right up in the top there, but I just love that flower print. Super gorgeous. And these bags are, you can be personalized too with whatever you would like to put on it. Inside my purse, I have my swap it pocket. And the swap it pocket consists of two larger zippered pouches on either side and a large spot in the center here. I just kind of threw my keys in here, some Kleenex. There's some um, black pouches here on either side, of a couple slots for pens and pencils. And then on the inside of that swap it pocket, you saw my Benjamin, and you know how much I love my Benjamin wallet. It has zipper teeth, so it's gonna hold up a long time. And then on the inside, I have all of my wallets and shopper reward card or credit cards, my shopper rewards cards, things like that. And then behind here, there's another um, section there, so you can just put stuff, receipts, whatever you want to put there. And then on the other side, let's see if I can show you this. There's a nice um, big section here for your checkbooks, whatever. I put my coins in this zippered section. And there's another section back there along with a spot for more cards. And then there's even one more pocket back there. So tons of room in this thing. Uh, this, I was using just your traditional wallet that you picked up at a department store like Macy's. And it just didn't, first of all, it didn't hold up. And second of all, it didn't hold all the cards that I needed. So this really has helped a lot, keeping everything in one spot. It's kept it organized. 
And I, when I was really pregnant with Lillian, I didn't want to carry a purse around with me because I was just I was so pregnant and just carrying a purse around, just it wasn't going to work for me. So I ended up buying a wrist strap to go with this. It has the hook on it here. And so when I went grocery shopping, that's all I carried with me is right here. It just was super easy and more convenient when I was that pregnant. But I just take that and toss that right in my swap it pocket. Now often I am going... When I go places, I'm going with Lillian, so I have a diaper bag. I don't always want to carry this whole bag with me, so that's why I love the Swap It Pocket. I take it out, and I throw it into my Cindy Tote. And the Cindy Tote is what I am currently using for my diaper bag. And I'll throw my Swap It Pocket in there, and I will show you the Cindy Tote. This is the Cindy Tote. Now, you can see it's... I don't know if I can step back far enough. It's a pretty good size bag. And they don't have this print anymore, but they still have the Cindy Toe. It has a zipper. Let's see if I can turn that down a little bit. It has a zipper on the top here. And then inside, you can see. There we go. You can see what I have in here. I have another zipper pouch. I threw my swap it pocket in here. And the zipper pouch, this, ladies, is my diaper bag. Now, when Lillian gets a little bit older, I may need to use two of these or rethink this. But for a newborn right now, this works perfectly. Inside the zipper pouch, I have an outfit, a onesie, two diapers, some wipers, and a burp cloth. And all that fits in here. As you can tell, there's, it's not really all that thick either. And this, I just throw in the Cindy Toe along with my Swap It Pocket and whatever else I carry in here. Usually I have my water bottle, which I don't have in here. I also have my nursing cover, so when I'm out and about, I can still feed Lillian discreetly. And this has been my go-to bag. My mom also has one of these. She uses it every Sunday for because she's the pianist at our church, and she just loves this bag. Now... If you want to use this bag as an office on the go, this holds the 31 uh, fold and file. This is the fold and file here. It's got some pockets on the front. In this case, I have my thank you notes, some stamps, address labels, pens, and my calculator. And then on the top, I have all of my files and file folders and everything organized here. And this actually fits very nicely inside the Cindy tote. So my mom uses, I believe she uses the fold and file, and she keeps her hymn book and anything that she needs to use to play for church on Sundays right inside her Cindy, um, her Cindy tote. And then if you like organizational type things like that, they have the double duty caddy. Now this would also fit inside your Cindy tote. It just depends on what, how much organization you need inside your Cindy tote and how you want to work it. There's a lot of different options out there for people. Um, this double duty caddy has the pockets on the outside here. I have my stapler. I have some giveaways here. And then on the other side, there's more pockets. I have my essential oils and my diffuser there. And then in the top, I don't know if you guys can see that without me tipping it, I have my um, all my scissors, pens and pencils, rulers, and then I have my scale. And this is what I can keep, this is what I keep on my desk currently, to keep everything in one spot because my kids kept moving things around my desk and I like having everything in one spot. Now if you love the Devil Duty Caddy, which my mom loves because she uses it for camping, she filled it up with paper plates, plastic cups, napkin silverware, and then when the kids wanted to help set the table when we were um, getting ready to eat, she'd just hand the whole double duty caddy to the kids and say, here, set the table. And it really eliminated one, bugs coming into the motorhome, and second of all, it eliminated the kids making all those trips in and out, in and out of the trailer. And with us having, well at the time we had six kids, uh, five of them always going in and out. That's a lot of extra traffic. So we try to really eliminate as much traffic as we can going in and out, particularly at dinner time when there's food coming out and we're cooking. So that has really helped her a lot. But 31 released 
for the spring, the triple duty caddy. And if you love the double duty caddy, you're going to love the triple duty caddy. The triple duty caddy is more like an office in a bag. Let's see if I can give you an idea on that. Okay, so you can see it has... If I can balance this, three pockets. It has a pocket that has this pouch here, a large center pouch, and then it has one over here. Now, if you don't want it to be that big, this one snaps. So it's just you can have just two pouches, or you can have you can open that up and have three pouches. Now I keep this on my desk along with my triple duty caddy, and then I think you guys can see that, right? I keep my three ring binder right in there like that. It has spots right out here for some pens, some personalization right there. And then the inside, I have just some more 31 catalogs and things I need to do. Put this back up here. And this really makes a great office on the go bag if you're looking for something a little bit it, just, it doesn't have any zippers, so it, you can't close it up, but it can just stay open, and you can grab whatever you need. The other thing I've seen people do with this is use this in the back of their trunk as a car organizer. Um, you could put your first aid kit in here. You could put tote bags in here for your grocery shopping. You can do um, jumper cables. I mean, that the possibilities are endless. It's pretty much whatever you want to creatively use. Now, this bag is a hostess exclusive. So in order to get this bag, you actually have to host a party, which I would be happy to do with you. I do Facebook and catalog parties right now. And if that's something you want to do for the month of March, they have double hostess rewards. So instead of earning $90 in hostess credits, you could earn $180. And that just tears right up. And this is a great hostess exclusive. I absolutely love my triple duty caddy. It's really helped keep things a little bit more organized. Now, I was talking about tote bags when we go grocery shopping. I love, I love the 31 grocery bags because I was so tired of giving my baggers at the grocery store those flimsy, those flimsy tote bags where they fight with them. You guys know. I'm sure you have them. The baggers have to fight with them to get them to stay open, and then they put stuff in, and then it sort of falls out, and it's just a pain to deal with. And I don't like plastic bags and using them, but I hate the drama that comes with using the fabric reusable bags. So let's see if I can find my bag here. Here we go. This is the essential storage tote. In other words, think of it like a standard brown paper grocery bag, except it's a little tiny bit bigger and it's far sturdier. And look at this. It stands up for your grocery, for your bagger. So there's no more fighting with it. He can just put this on the trolleys. Um, I don't know if you have them in other countries, but when the baggers come through or when the food comes through the thing and it's been checked out, it, at the end, the bagger is there with his bag and there's this round thing that they have all their plastic bags on. But these can actually fit right on there so it's just like regular bagging. It's no different except you're using a higher quality bag that's not going to rip. It's not going to tear. And it just, I love these bags. I have several of these for my grocery shopping. You guys know that I shop at Aldi's. So this is awesome for Aldi's. This is called the Large Utility Tote. It has a wire frame all around the top so it keeps its shape and this thing is perfect you throw this inside the cart at all these just like that you can throw your food on the inside and then when you get to the checkout you just pretty much put it all on the counter but this thing it's a big bag but it's perfect for the beach or anything that you want to tote, tote in it I use this when we were going um, Chris, up to for Christmas at my mom's, I filled this one up with Christmas presents because it just held everything in there. And you know when you get in, um, when you go grocery shopping and some vehicles have, like my minivan, it doesn't really have much of a ledge, so the things go rolling around in the trunk. Well, this is the answer to your problems with this. Throw it all in here, it'll stay up, and you know, don't have rolling apples or cabbage or anything like that anymore. So this is the large utility tote. This is $35. 
if you want something a little bit more, a little bit bigger, more deluxe, this is the deluxe utility tote. You can see it's a little bit bigger and it has the handles on either end. But what I like about this is the essential storage tote that I showed you guys. Two of these fit inside the deluxe utility tote like that. I only have one in there. So when you guys go home with your groceries, you can just carry the whole thing in with your two bags right inside of it. Super handy. The deluxe utility tote is $50. They both, they also sell clear um, PVC lids to go with these. I'm not, I'm not sure I have my lids in here, but the lids are just very flexible, but they keep everything nice and clean. So again, if you were going to the beach and say you wanted to fill this up with towels, you can throw the lid on and keep all those towels nice and clean in the back of your trunk. All right, a couple more things. We're talking about the beach and it can be really hot. You want, you guys know how much I love my large thermal um, the name is escaping me of what thermal it is, but that thing holds a ton of groceries. And it's, what is it called? Market. Charity says it's the fresh market thermal. So I don't have that. That's actually out in my vehicle right now. But 31 has a lot of thermal options for lunches and things. This is one of their new prints for this season. And I don't know if you guys can see that. It's like a greeny turquoise color on a navy blue and then this is an embroidered flower here so this you have a paddle trick there this is a larger tote um thermal open it up and you can see how big that is inside you can fit a lot of food in there because the bottom is larger and it tapers towards the top. There's also a spot here for your napkin or your silverware, whatever you wanted. You can um, wipe the inside out if it gets dirty. Now, if you guys have kids, you might want to get a tote that is completely, or a thermal that is completely washable. And 31 has, I believe it's called the On The Go Thermal. Let's see if I can get the picture up for you guys here. All right, here it is. Yes, it's the go-to thermal, right? I don't know if you guys can see these. These are completely washable, so they're perfect for kids because kids can make a mess in their lunch boxes. And those are $18. Um, they have lots of different, oh, thank you, Judy. They have lots of different thermals that are available that, you know, you can pick what you like better. They're all very impressive. Now, this is my charity just ran out for me. I'm sure if you watch YouTube, you guys have seen this many, many times. This is my Fresh Market Thermal. And I have fit, I believe it was four gallons of milk, a couple pounds of frozen peas, some cheese, um, some frozen sausage. And this thing was bulging. And this thing has held up beautifully to a lot of use and abuse. And this is perfect for our size family. Like, if we want to go on a picnic, this thing gets filled up with food. It stays cold for hours. And again, it's been one of my favorite purchases from 31. Uh, if you guys like big tote bags, there's this fold over weekender. Now this thing is huge. Um, for the month of March, um, most of their totes are 50% off with a $35 purchase. So this fold over weekender is usually $80, but with your $35 purchase, this is only $40. Huge savings if you're in for a bag like this. And why they call it the fold over. Let me tip this down here. So it's huge, right? But it, you don't you might not go with all needing all that space. So this just folds over and it has the clip right here that just goes over and clips on a bag like that. And you have a smaller bag right here. Now this is filled with my kids' toys right now. Mary loves this bag. It's big enough to fit Grace into it, and they love pulling each other around in it on my hardwood floors. If that doesn't tell you how sturdy this bag is to hold up to my kids using this as a pretty much a toe behind. It's a heavier canvas material, so it really is going to hold up. It's not 
well, it's heavy because I have kids blocks in it right now, but it's not a heavy bag, so it's really easy to pack. They have lots of fun prints in this one. This was their fall print. I don't think this one's available. Hi, Mary. I'm Katie. It's time to eat? All right, well, I'll be down in just a minute. You want to say hi to everybody? Hi. There we go. We'll lift you. Hi. There. There's Mary. There's my agency money. Okay. Okay, guys. Go eat your lunch. All right, I'll be down in a few minutes. Lydia, would you like to say hi? Hi. <laughs> go ahead and please close the door for Mommy. All right. Um, so that is the holdover weekender. I'm going to wrap this up shortly. I'll show you another item here. This is the expand -a toe Now, several of you, when you watched my Facebook party yesterday, commented how much you love this. This is a very lightweight, it's not a canvas. Um, it's kind of a slippery material, so you can um, easily wipe this down. And this one, you can see, is huge. I don't, it, I mean, it's giant, it's a giant bag. This would be perfect for um, overnight, weekends, um, or maybe just a big traveling. Let's see, can you guys get grasp how big that is? But the beauty about this thing is it's a big bag now, but just like it's, it says it's an expand the by putting the zipper all the way around the bag. It shrinks. It shrinks the tote into a more manageable size. So it's like a two-for-one bag. If you need it really big, you have it. And if you don't, you can shrink it. So there, you, there it is, shrunken. Um, again, it's perfect for blankets, beach towels. If you have a lot to pack or maybe you're going and you want to have enough room for souvenirs coming back home, this would be the bag for you because then when you got there, you only packed it, not expanded, and then when you got there, you filled it up, expanded the bag, and it's big enough, and it would be a good bag for that. And you can see, I love the hot pink, and this was embroidered with um, 31 on it. Um, I think that's, there's so much I could show you. I have a ton of stuff, guys, but I don't want to overwhelm you all. So that just kind of gives you a taste. If there's something that you want to see, um, leave it in the comments below, and I can do another video on some of the items that you might want to see. I will put in the description a link to the party link. Um, when you go to that website, you'll see my parties on the upper right-hand side. You click that, and you'll see YouTube fan pages, so you can just go right there and look at the product line. I will also put in the um, description below a uh, link for the catalog so it's more like a flipping experience makes it a little bit easier than the website if you guys want to check that out and again the March specials are for every $35 you spend you get a half price um, item off the tote so some of those are really a great savings if you're in the market for some of those and if you're interested in hosting a party with me they are um, Double hostess rewards for every $500 and up words that you collect in orders. And they're a ton of fun. I usually do them on Facebook because it works really well. And it's just like this. It's a live party. I do some giveaways and things like that. But hopefully this will load better for you guys. And if you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this answers some of your questions about what I've been doing. And I guess I will talk to you guys in a little while. Okay, bye.